Hello everybody, Lady B here. I got tagged by I am one ugly guy and he wants to know what my knife is that got it all started. And he wasn't for sure if I'd remember. But <laughs> yeah, I do. Okay, here it is. And we'll get it now. It's heavy. Oh, let me get it out here. Oh, y'all ready for this? <laughs> this little thing is what got it all started for me. Now, there's a story behind it. I worked at a wholesale flower shop or wholesale florist, whatever you want to call it. They sold wholesale to all the flower shops in town and the nearest towns around. And I had to have me a knife. This is a buck knife. I went to Walmart, and yes, it's made in China. I went to Walmart and bought it because I always had to have a knife to cut string and boxes and stems and stuff like that. And I didn't want to buy me a cheap knife. I only paid $10 for it, so it wasn't bad. <laughs> you expected to get something that was really big and bad and dangerous. Well, this is it. Well, you ask. <laughs> but this is what got it all started for me. This was my very first knife ever. But anyhow, it's, it's worked, and I've used it more times than I can say. And also, you didn't ask for a second one, but this I picked up at a gun show. And it's not much either, but it is the K-Bar ZK Acheron. That's what I found out that it was. Anyhow, this thing's had a lot of bad reviews. Said it's not sharp coming out of the, the box, and it's really not. But I did put a nice little edge on it. Maybe you can see it there. I did sharpen it, and it's pretty sharp now. And they said it does come out of the sheath. Well, I have tried and tried and tried, and it will not come out. I've tried, and it's really hooked in there pretty good. I just put it on a, a piece of paracord here. And once I put it on and under my shirt, uh, it you can't see it. And no, I'm not going to demonstrate that. <laughs> but anyhow, it's uh, pretty good. It's cheap, but you know, when money's an issue, you have to buy what you can afford. I'd rather have this than nothing. But anyhow, this is my second knife. And I like it a lot. But anyhow, I might, might uh, wrap the handle in paracord later. I don't know. But it fits my hand. It's a real nice knife. So it's not bad in my opinion. And now this one I picked up at a gun show also. And this one, <laughs> it looks bad, but it's really not. But this to get it so you can see it. I just like the way that one looked. Call me big, bad, and dangerous or whatever, but not that I'll ever even have to use it. The guy that I talked to tried to sell me a pink one, and I am really not a pink kind of person, but anyhow, I like the way it fits my hand. There's a little thing here on the end that keeps my hand from sliding off the end, and it's real nice. Like I said, I'll probably never have to use it. And it's got this really nice sheath to it. And this unlocks it, the blade inside so it doesn't come out. But anyhow, that's my other knife. But my big bad knife here is the one that got it all started. <laughs> but anyhow, um, I'm supposed to tag a couple of people. And I'm going to really try to tag three because I don't know if they've been tagged before. And I would much rather tag an extra person than not enough. But anyhow, I'd like to tag Genius in Exile, and it's just the way it sounds, G-E-N-I-U-S-I-N-E-X-I-L-E, -E -E, Mailroom Elf, just the way it sounds, and Mahalik 33. Uh, that is spelled M-A-H-A-L-Y-C-3-3. But anyhow, if I can figure out how to put whoops, how to put their names below in a link, I will do that. But I'm not sure if I can figure that out. I'm still trying to figure this YouTube thing out and making videos. But anyhow, uh, another little thing to I am one ugly guy. 
yes, I will make you some sauce. And maybe this summer I can bring it up. But like I said, once word gets out, I'm going to have to bring a lot. So, yes, I will make you some sauce. And I'm sorry I didn't send you any for Christmas. But anyhow, yes, I will. And you have my word on that. But anyhow, I thank everybody for subbing me. And I don't know why you did, but I hope y'all won't let you down in the meantime. But I hope to be putting out some more videos. But um, I appreciate everybody watching. Thank you and take care.